Surgical knot tie-in consists of several knots, which are carried out one after the other. Let's see how to do them correctly. Among all the existing knots, there are two types that we must know and use routinely, since they are used very frequently. These are the basic knot with the middle finger and the basic knot with the index finger, which we must know how to knot with both the right hand and the left hand. We will start by making the knots with the right hand. We cross the ends, leaving at the bottom the end that we will handle with the right hand. The left hand just holds the thread perpendicular to the tissue and keeps the tension, which should not be excessive. The right hand is the one that will do all the knotting. From this position, which we will call the starting position, we take the end of the thread between the index finger and the thumb, we turn the wrist, we push the thread with the little finger, and with the middle finger, we pass the other end of the thread, and we pull it with the help of the right finger. We keep pulling with the middle finger and the thumb, thus forming the knot, which we lower and tighten with the index finger so that it's completely flat on the tissue. Let's see it again. The knot must always be crossed and alternate so that they remain fixed. For this purpose, we will make the second type of knot, the basic knot with the index finger. This is the first position. We take the end of the thread between the thumb and the middle finger and we tighten with the index finger. We bring it closer to the other end of the thread. Release the index finger and take the end again with the help of the middle finger. The thumb and the index finger again, which is the one that lowers and tightens the knot. We balance the tension on the two ends at all times so that the knot is flat on the tissue. Let's see it again. It is important to remember that the knot is always made by lowering it with the index finger. And finally, we will cross and alternate again the knots successively, which will be flat and crossed. Depending on the type of tissue and sutter, we will make more or less knots. 